we get a Vail G6 only save in West Virginia. Okay, you know I like to test things in the real world, and in this case, we're using Vail G6. I have a rental car, which is a Nissan Murano Gray, so it's pretty, pretty good size. Uh, headlights, fog lights, and some chrome. So what I did before we left, since we didn't put a jammer in here, wanted to make sure I was driving with two things. A good laser detector, which the uh, we find the Max Cam 360C is one of the best to come out of Escort in years and a Vail G6, easy to put on a rental car. We did the headlights, the fog lights, and a little bit of the chrome, and uh, no front plate. And here we are in West Virginia, and I see an officer with his window down, running laser outside of a construction zone. So we head up, flip around, and come back, because we figured he was targeting that way. And sure enough, we're in the left lane, we parked ourselves out in the left lane, and we got lasered and it appeared that we got lasered all the way down to point blank range you have to consider that the max cam 360c alerts for about two seconds longer than the presence of laser now there wasn't any cars really behind me to speak of that could have been targeted and there you have it seconds of alerting time so uh, again here's proof in the real world can't get any better than that in the real world. And for those who question the efficacy of Vail, well, I can tell you where to go because it's very clear when you're driving that the Vail can work for you with a good laser detector. There he is. Let's see if we can die. There we go. Laser. behind me so he was on me that whole time so there's the value of having a good laser detector and the max cam 360c is and you can even see on an suv that we're driving gray crossover that he had to target me for a while and uh, that's really good so that's veil g6 only so for all you doubters out there you can pound sand because there's proof that it works. So thanks for watching.